Hello, hello, hi, hello. My name, my name, hi. My name is Aaron Holstein. Hi, I'm Aaron Holstein. I'm a person, a dad, a husband, a friend, a producer, a photographer. I'm a musician, video producer, and creator from Colorado, USA. I'm turning 50 one week from today. My first Vibe Squad release was in 2006, 15 years ago. I estimated that I played over 2,000 Vibe Squad shows. But by 2016, I had become so burnt. I was afraid my creativity had completely dried up. And if any of you have ever experienced that feeling, it's terrifying. I had become completely miserable. I felt empty. I made an announcement that I was going to stop touring. My last few music performances of that time, I would just sit in the dressing room alone and then go out. I felt like people hated my music. I lost all my creative confidence. I knew I wasn't any fun to be around, and so I stayed home. I lost touch with a lot of friends. I played my final Vibe Squad show in November of 2016, and I thought I would be really sad afterwards, but I was relieved. It had taken it all out of me. I was tired of being on the road. For my mental and physical health, I quit drinking alcohol. Being a musician or a DJ or a performer it's one of the rare jobs where when you get to work, they say, hey, what do you want to drink tonight? It was essential that I break the self-destructive cycle I was in. My goal with making music my whole life was to make people feel good. I wanted to make music that, that felt great and that made you want to dance. So the fact that I had become miserable in my own life and really only was feeling like making sad music and I don't really feel like sharing music like that. Music is magic. Music is medicine. After that last Vibe Squad show, I didn't do any music for months. But let me be very clear, my intention was never to stop doing music. It was to stop the touring lifestyle that had become really destructive in my life. I've played guitar since I was 10 years old, and I hadn't picked one up in maybe five years. So I started playing guitar again and bass. I started playing piano every day. I started playing drums. When I was a kid, all I wanted to do was play drums. I made an album with my friend and drummer, Shane Egan. It's called Back Into The Fold. I played guitar, bass, keyboards, and sang. Shortly after we played our first show, Shane died. I was so depressed over it and I wrote a social media post just trying to connect. One friend responded by saying, please make this the reason why you never stop making music and not the reason why you quit. I made a record intended for falling asleep to or waking up to called Drift. There's no drums. It's lo-fi keyboards and piano and roads. During lockdown, I put out a Vibe Squad EP called Empathy Waves. I just released my first full-length backpacked album. It's called Endings or Beginnings. I really poured myself into this record. It's got the feels.
I'm reflecting a lot, honestly. And I've been reflecting about everything. On my 50th birthday, I am releasing a new Aaron Holstein one-man band full-length album. I feel like I spent my first half of my musical life looking for other people to play with, looking for my band. There was a point I realized that my energy would be better spent just learning how to do all this stuff myself. So I did. I play guitar, bass, keyboards, drums, percussion. I used the guitar that I got when I was 12 years old. I started a new record label called Hardy Records. It's the home for all of my musical projects going forward. Vibe Squad set in Denver a few weeks ago, and every time I do, uh, someone says, oh, I thought you quit music. While I don't expect to return to full-time touring ever, my intention is to perform a couple times a month, sometimes as Vibe Squad, sometimes as Backpack, sometimes as Aaron Holstein.